Welcome back to Virginia This Morning. This Partners in Healthcare segment is presented by Odyssey Healthcare. They take a patient-centered approach, providing compassionate care and support for people at the end of life and their families. Jennifer Jones and Teddy Dombrowski join us this morning from Odyssey Healthcare. Welcome, ladies. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks, Thanks for, for coming us. in. Thanks. Appreciate it. Now, there's a misconception about hospice, and Odyssey Healthcare is, is focused on hospice care. Tell us, tell us people have an idea of what this is, but what is it? One of the uh, biggest misconceptions about hospice is that hospice is a place when actually hospice is a philosophy of caregiving. There's also many misconceptions clinically surrounding hospice. One of the misconceptions is that you have to be physically dying, you know, mm -hmm. moments or days left and many people tell us that they wish they called hospice in sooner because our main goal is to provide aggressive treatment of symptom, symptom management so that a quality of life can be preserved throughout the remainder of life and our goal is to help people live as fully as possible for as long as possible. And a lot of people may think that hospice focuses only on the patient but that's not true. It's a, it's a holistic approach with families as well. Yeah. Absolutely and we consider um, giving the gift of hospice as a journey mm -hmm. and to have an opportunity to prepare for that journey and the journey may change but I know if you think of it as going on a trip many of us would want to prepare you know and and having that opportunity at end of care life you know to treat this as a journey is something that it's the approach that we like to take. And mm -hmm. Odyssey Healthcare is very familiar with this. It's, it is a big company although it's very it's localized. There's Odyssey Healthcare of Richmond. We are the nation's largest hospice provider, so we are an experienced hospice provider, but we do have the resources to actually be able to treat our patients and family as they're our only patient and family receiving our services. So we're very fortunate in that regard. And right now, families uh, during the holidays are probably seeing more of each other, um, probably becoming more aware of needs that maybe mm -hmm. they weren't during the rest of the year. How does that impact what you guys do during the holidays? Do you see an increase? Yes, we do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's, it's funny you should say that because when, um, when families come to visit, sometimes that's when the real discussions take place. You know, something's different, something's, something's going on. And I think that families are more concerned with making sure that their loved ones are taken care of um, after the holidays. Maybe they live out of town or whatever. And um, we have nurses and staff who can evaluate, who can tell if somebody's appropriate for hospice. It's not, um, it's not something that a, a decision that would have to be made by a family member alone. We have a team of uh, social workers, aides, chaplains, bereavement coordinators, there's, there's a whole team of people who are just waiting to help that family and go where they are, match their goals to our goals, you know, to, to try to give them the kind of experience that they want to have because hospice isn't one size fits all, it's geared to the individual. It is highly personalized and I, I think many people may struggle with when is the right time, how do I know, but there are, as you said, a team of people ready to help. Mm -hmm. And, and we are, and we're 24-7. You know, we actually can have all of our service in place within three hours. Our response time is something that, you know, really makes us shine as a hospice provider. And, and like Teddy was saying, you know, once you're with families around the holidays and maybe you or your family are going through maybe a life-limiting illness um, and think that you might have a loved one that may be hospice appropriate, we can be called 24 hours a day, seven days a week, come out and evaluate and, and, and like I just stated, have all of our services in place within three hours. Well, thanks for sharing, ladies. Let's let people know how to get in touch. Sure. Odyssey Healthcare of Richmond, improving the quality of life. One of your partners in healthcare, give them a call, 282-4617, or visit odysseyhealthcare.com.